Hello guys, it is Lasgo Tony. I'm back with another episode of The Simpsons Tapped Out. So yeah, we're going to be going over this fire station update that just came out today. So let's get right into it. Chief, help. I was having a Christian book burning and the words, works of L. James got out of control. People just keep adding more and more to them. Our, our next available appointment is Friday. Would you prefer 8 to 12 or 1 to 5? Friday, but the fire could spread to my house. I need it now. Sorry, but we're backed up with fires. It hasn't rained once in this town since this town was rebuilt, and everything's dried out. Then what do I do? What anyone around here does and when they need somewhere to go. So we are going to be going over the quest. Part 1. So, first we need to make Flanders move into the brown house and make Springfield throw L. James' books in the fire. So, let's get right into that. Oh, so let's get a couple people to throw some books into a fire. One more, and okay. Now we'll speed them up to find where they go. Okay, there we go. So let's go to Flanders' house and speed up everyone else. There we go. And we still have Flanders. So we'll speed him up because I have no clue. Oh, he's going to the Browns house. And there we go. So we didn't start the fire. Part 1. Collect your reward. Crook and Ladder. Who's setting the mystery mysterious fires around Springfield? Build the fire station before Springfield goes up in flames. It's time for Springfield's sexiest firefighters to suit up and investigate. Finish all the quests before April 8, 14th to earn all new content. Homer, this is ridiculous. We need a fire department. And who would I staff with in it? New characters? Ha! They've already introduced everyone, even character who only appeared in deleted scenes. Why don't we volunteer as firefighters? And why would we want to do to do work for no money? Because if there's a terrorist attack that kills some of us, the ones who will survive will get to comfort the widows. I'm in. Me too. Me three. Me four. Can I do this and still get paid as a cop? So part one is make men volunteer for the fire department. So we need four people to unlock Chief Mo. So we have... One, not a man, two, three, and four. So we'll speed them up. If I can get to them. Let's see where they are headed, and we shall go there. So we'll clean up what people have been doing in Springfield, and speed up the volunteer firefighters. There we go. So looks like we have our new firemen. All right. Time to get us some hot widows. I'm just excited to get a few minutes away from Mother. And a few minutes away from Manjula, the store, and all eight of my children. Why eight? So get a Pooh and Homer new fireman skins unless you want them in a third degree burn skins later on. So we will get fireman Homer and a Pooh for a hundred donuts. I'm in it f for the good of the town, I swear. Fire Chief Mo. So that's part two. Where's my next photo shoot? Fireman Homer. I'm an American hero. Fireman a poo. So that's four of them. The Quickie Mart is on fire. Sorry, I was trying to dry my socks in the hot dog roller. I tried dousing it with squishies, but the it only fed the flames. The stuff's 90% propane. Oh, our first time. I'm gonna gotta take a selfie from me fighting it for Springface. So we need to make firemen fight the Quickie Mart fire. Okay, fires are popping up all around town. Tap on them for medals. So our first one seems to be all the way over here. So we get a nice 20 medals from that. And we'll speed up someone to put out the fire in the Quickie Mart. Okay, whatever. Let's just skip that. And there we go. So that's finished. So before we continue, we will get the crooks and ladders. The first item we can get is the vehicle pile up, which costs 75 donuts if I saw correctly. And we can just put that 
in the middle of our spring field because why the heck not and I have nowhere else to put it so we'll place it right over here we can also get the burning bush which is a common item which you can get otherwise yeah. but an item we can't get always is the fireworks so let's buy a couple fireworks here and there and see if they have any cool animations so there's that and cool so this one spins and this one just sends out random fireworks which is pretty nice so with this we are going to be able to finish the quest a lot fa faster because this gives us 100 medals every time we speed it up so that's going to get us 300 medals we need for the next prize there we go the fire is out my soul's crushing place of employment has been saved ah but the picture didn't come out the fire is all blurry let's start it again so you've unlocked the fundraise animate job for fireman mo so that's part three well done man in honor of you saving one of Springfield's oldest structures, I hereby present you with this medal. This medal says Pinewood Derby 2003. Ah, some heroes you are. So the next one we need is make Quimby award a medal. And also we need to have to collect a bunch of gold medals. So what I'll do is I'll just go and I'll be fun and we'll do all the quests that are actually available for these people okay so we still have the poo but we'll speed up all these other guys and go to where they are so that's homer and we'll go to mo who's fundraising and finally we shall go to quimbu who's awarding us a medal so we're going to go back to the vehicle pile up so we can speed this process up so it doesn't take us too long Okay, a couple more times should do the trick. There we go. So, a couple more times. Do we just need to speed this up? And afterwards, I'll just keep cutting back and forth once I get all the stuff. Ah, dang it. I keep clicking the wrong thing. Uh, one more after this, and we will have the complete thing. And the... F oh, cool. So, do you want to place this? Yes, we will place the fire truck we just unlocked. So that's part four. Help! Krusty Land is on fire! I wonder who started that one. Hee <laughs> hee. We don't have safe places that take our money, but offer us only superb service from people in stupid-looking uniforms. Help! The police station is on fire! Oh my god, let's go! So we need to do that, and... It has a nice little siren. So what I'll do is I'll quickly cut out here, and... We will be back once we get the next award. Okay, so we're back. Chief, the fire was caused by the microwave in the break room exploding. Yeah, so, a microwave wouldn't explode unless it was used at least 100,000 times. Yeah, so, but there's only five of you who work there. Yeah, so, and you've only been working there for four years. Yeah, so, so that means each of you are taking 10,000 breaks a day in the break room. Yeah, so, all those fire drills are finally paying a fireman skinner. So that's the complete set of firefighters. So that's part five. I don't get it. There are no hydrants in this town. What are you fighting fires with? With fires? That's a thing, right? Come on, Lisa. No four-year-old fire freemium game is going to hire animators just to design hydrants. They haven't even hired someone to figure out how to make us walk in more than two directions. I know. Last night it took me 15 minutes to get from the living room to the kitchen. So fire hydrants are now available in the store. Let your firefighters do the walking. So we will go to the store and buy some fire hydrants, which cost us ten donuts a or ten donuts a piece, which is kind of ridiculous. Let's think they're necessities for most towns. And they, no, oh my God, they're useless fire hydrants too. So our next item thing is a couple animations. What I'll do is I'll probably just skip through the animations and come back once I get the building itself. So yeah, see you then. Okay, so we are back, and we are just about to get the final thing, which is the fire base. So, let's place it down right now. It's a pretty large size building, and it's, it's part nine. So, congratulations! You've completed Crook and Ladder. Continue the story to see what Ralph does to help. I'm fire. Oof. Hooray! Now we have a place to avoid our wives when we're not avoiding them by actually fighting fires. Wait, 
Is this fire station now on fire? How could this happen? I was blowing some water to make some ramen since the only thing firemen know is cook is real life, but they got distracted in next calls from people reporting fires. We need to hire a 911 operator. We need a lot of things, but first the Simpsons needs to make a new episode with something new characters. Hey, I got some for the job and already exists. Who's that? My foot's name is Jeremy. So we need to hire Rolf as a 911 operator, which seems like a horrific idea, but we will see how it goes. There we go. That's part 10. Okay, Ralph, just pick up this phone and say 911. What's your emergency? Ring, ring. 8, 2, banana! I got an owie on my breathing. Close enough. Now that we've got figured out... Oh, whatever, let's just skip through this. So we need to fight the fire station fire. Which is the most ridiculous thing we can do. I'm not sure what this is actually is, but I... Oh, so it seems that Burns is the one that's been doing this. What a scumbag. So we need to have Mo also fight the fire station fire. GG. Setting your own station on fire. And we have one more, which is Homer. There we go. So that's part 11, and the fire station is now on fire. Ring, ring. Hello, emergency residents. Help me. 911, there's a fire at Luigi's. Come quick. Meatballs are fun. What? There are no way we go out. So we need to have Ralph set him. So that's that. So let's have Mr. Burns set fire in another Springfield. So we'll quickly do that. So one, two, three. Burning your place down. Ha 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 ha. I'm a scumbag. Okay. So we are now back in our Springfield in a second or two. Hopefully. There we go. So it's that only is part one, oddly enough, but yeah. So yeah, guys, I am going to end it off here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and see you next.